Today I want to talk about making decisions ahead of time. Making the decision before the decision needs to be made. Like, for example, we do it for vacations. We plan ahead where we want to go, what sites we want to see, what activities we want to take part of, even if we want to see some friends and family while we're away, or if we want to connect with other people that we haven't seen for a long time. Or take, for example, the holidays. We plan our favorite foods, for Thanksgiving, we plan our tree, we decide whether we need to have more decorations or if we want to have new special decorations to commemorate our first Christmas together as married people or if we are commemorating um, baby's first Christmas or whatever. I've been doing the no sugar and no flour thing and mostly no corn for two months now. And except for the flu, which I had for a week and a half, I've got energy to burn. But it's not been easy. And if I hadn't made the decision ahead of time, that major decision on September 23rd, that I was not going to have sugar and flour and mostly corn, I would have had to fight with myself every time I saw a chewy chocolate chip cookie or a piece of pumpkin cheesecake or even a stack of nachos covered with cheese. But I chose ahead of time. I made the decision before I needed to, which has taken away the fight for the most part. There are still things that are hard and your decision doesn't have to be the same as mine. It can be as simple as choosing not to eat anything while standing. That would help with those holiday cocktail parties. Or you could choose not to drink anything with calories until you've had your 75 ounces of water. Then you can maybe dilute your wine with some soda water or um, sparkling water and that would take half the calories away. As you navigate the, through the holidays, Remember to make your decisions before you need to make them. Plan for what's important. Choose ahead of time for what you want to focus on because the temptations will come. They will bombard you and you will either have to fight to stay away from something or fight not to have something or the, you'll give in. You need to not have to make decisions at the party. You may also have to choose to exercise ahead of time. And no matter what happens, you're gonna go out and do something. So, what do you wanna choose? Do you want to choose health this holiday season? Or do you wanna just go with the flow and make a New Year's resolution for January? It's your choice. Just saying, I feel really good since I've been eating healthier. My body feels good and I think I look pretty hot, but that's my opinion. So we'll talk to you later.